Foodie Friday, we even have a chauffeur this time. Kat found out it was sushi, so she was like, I'm going. Yeah. Yep. So. I have to send it back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go get it. We got it. So here we are, yes, after going to Sushi and Kitchen, which is located that way. It's uh, at the corner of Route 6 and Skanakonek Road in Fairhaven. You know I don't do these. So. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're just a prop for him. Just go right to Mr. Fork. They're a tool for me. So what do I have here? Uh, uh, Kat was the one who told us what to do. Kat's what? the sushi uh, informant that we have. Mm-hmm. So she we and, have. She and Sarah love it. If I'm correct, yeah. we have a Cali roll, California roll. We have a spicy tuna roll. We have a Philadelphia roll. Yeah. And the last one, shrimp tempura. Thank shrimp you. Shrimp tempura. Thank you. Okay. So we have four. So, and did you say there's a sushi rule? You have to eat it all in one bite? I don't know if it's a rule as much as it is, how would you do anything else? If you yeah. take one bite and you try and eat half of it. It all falls apart. It's all falling apart. Yeah. I don't know how you'd manage to, to survive by you taking a bite. Okay. So yeah, Pete's got the fork. I'm going to try my chopstick skills it's yet again. It's going to be easier with my hands, I think. But is that, is that frowned upon? You would also just make a mess. Oh, okay. Yeah, so so which one are we having first? Yeah. Is my plate set up like yours? Shrimp tempura, which is the uh, the one that has the most green to us. Okay. Um, this one? Cat, coach him, please. <laughs> and now coming in from the sidelines, which one? Shrimp tempura. That one. Oh, okay. my dumpling skills have weakened. Oh, you can't pick it up? Hold on. Just All give right. me a second. Oh, no. It's, it's going to fall apart. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What happened? What happened to me? You know, a fork works wonderfully. Yeah, that's if you don't have skill like this, Pete. Okay. We're doing we it. Cheers. Hey, you did it again. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you. I always do that. A little nervous. A little nervous. Here we go. Wow. All right. Mm. That's very good. What is it again? That is really good. Shrimp tempura. I'm not going to lie. I was mm. not expecting that to be that tasty. I was a little nervous. I hadn't had sushi in a long time. I had it before. Oh, I forgot about the soy sauce. Oh, we do you're supposed to sauce. dip them all in soy sauce? I mean, I'm, hey, I'm going to say it straight up, though. That was really good without soy yeah, sauce. Yeah, without soy sauce. All right, Kat, which one's next, Coach? That's the California one. You want us to go with that one next? We're going California. All right. All right. A little soy oh, for the sushi. I don't know if mine's going to make the dunk. Okay. A little soy for the soul. Are we cheersing on all four? Yep, cheers. Uh, cheers. Oh, my. Oh, oh my no. awesome. All right, we're just going to go for it. I'm being coached that I need to go back for more for the for the cukes. Do you like the soy sauce? Yes, I do like the soy sauce. It does enhance the mm. experience. I think I like the first one better. I agree. But that was okay. But that was good. Mm -hmm. That was good. I think it would also have been better if the cucumbers went with the sushi instead mm -hmm. of eating them separately. That was good, yeah. All right, coach. What's next? That one's the Philadelphia. Philadelphia. The Philadelphia. So this is similar to the Cali, right? But it has cream cheese. Yeah, that one has cream cheese and I think that one has salmon. Salmon. This one has salmon? Is Pete doing okay over there, Cap? All right. Hey, hey. Cheers. Cheers. Here we go. Uh, Philadelphia. Definitely got the cream cheese on that. Not bad. I'm not one of my favorites. I'm I still can't liking... tell if I like that better or worse than the California roll. I'm still liking the tempura the best. That was the best. Mm. Mm. I got the aftertaste of cream cheese. I like cream cheese in moderation. That was a little too much. And this is called what? So this is a little nerve-wracking for me. I'm Pete. a little, yeah. He I don't like, like the word spicy. spicy stuff, so. I do like tuna, um, and I do okay. But I heard this isn't super spicy. So soy sauce again. Soy sauce. Okay. Cheers. Oop, it's falling off. Cheers. Here we go. Oh, no! <laughs> All right, here we go. Hmm. Rescue mission. Luckily, it's in one piece. Really gonna get the soy sauce on this one. A little spicy. All right, here we go. Here we go. Hmm. 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 Mm hmm. <laughs> yeah, this is the the spice takes a, a second. Mm. It hits your mouth, takes a second, then it hits, but it's not that spicy. No, it's not. I, I've had spicier. It's a it's a comforting spicy. It lingers mm. there for a little bit, but it doesn't burn, which is good. That's what you want in spicy stuff. Here's it. A little bit of spice, not a lot of burn. All right. The, the words of wisdom here. So did you just say we were going to rate all four of them? I think we should rank them kind of, or what, what we have. Okay. And then, and then we'll give sushi an overall rating. I actually think 
that I will rank them in the way we ate them. I think my favorite right, one by one. Yeah, my favorite was the first one, shrimp tempura. Shrimp tempura. Then the California roll was All okay, right. but I liked one better. And the the cream, the Philadelphia. Yeah. And they didn't like the spice. I could go over, and the spice was last, but it was not. You know, wasn't bad. It's just I'm not a spicy guy, and it wasn't super hot. So yeah, I would go one, two, three, four. <sighs> hmm. I think I'm gonna go the shrimp tempura number one. That was really good. Mm-hmm. It was really good. Then I think the spicy tuna. Okay. Then the California roll. Then the Philadelphia. Because you're not a cream cheese. You, you weren't a fan of the cream cheese. Like I said, I like cream cheese sometimes on, on bagels and such. Mm. Uh, buffalo chicken dip. Yep. Uh, yep. Taquitos. I'll have cream cheese. Very good. Did you know uh, when we were in Virginia last week, they're having a cream cheese shortage. Are they? Yes. I needed it to bake something. We ended up Googling a, a, a you know, what to replace it with. Yeah. All right. Let's rank sushi as a whole. Just sushi in general. Right. Wait, how do you rank it out of 10? What do you got? I think I'll go six out of 10. A six out of 10 on sushi. Yeah. For you. It's not, it wasn't bad. It wasn't disappointing. Yeah. But it wouldn't be like if you said, what do you want to grab for dinner tonight? I, I don't think sushi would be in my, my Fair top, enough. top Fair three enough. or four. I think I'm going to go seven out of 10. Oh, okay. I enjoyed it. I'll have it on occasion. Mm-hmm. Not not my go-to food, but seven out of 10. It was pretty good. Mm-hmm. I, I Again, I had it like maybe once or twice before. So that was a while. So it was if, pretty good. If you like sushi, we give a thumbs up to uh, Sushi and Kitchen in Fairhaven. Yep. Recommended to us by uh, Justin, right? Justin yeah. also said he had gone Justin there. and his girlfriend. Bree, yeah. shut up. So, and if there's something else you think we should try on a future Foodie Friday, just let us know if it's a local place or if it's a chain restaurant that you've heard they, they have something we should try. Let us know. And that'll be a future Foodie Friday. By the way, Cat's driving my car. Well, it, our car. <laughs> this our was, car. This was B-roll, buddy. We weren't supposed to be talking. Okay. <laughs> you doing it? Hey. Oh. <laughs> we got it. Let's go. Ah! <laughs>